Sometimes it's uh, it's unavoidable to talk um, about people, for example, who came to Berlin as a consequence of forced migration, or about people with a refugee background, um, because that part of the community uh, is suffering from certain uh, circumstances. Um, uh, for example, from uh, in terms of uh, the obligations that the state uh, is putting on them, or their legal status, and um, these uh, this situation is true only to a, a certain group of people. And so, for example, when I talk about or when we talk about residents of Tempelhof, sometimes uh, it's necessary to to use terminology like uh, like refugee because um, you're talking about their particular about these people. Uh, in, in that case, as a refugee. But the point of saying um, new Berliner or newcomer is that in other situations where you're not talking particularly about the challenges that you face as a person who came as a consequence of forced migration, um, but rather about your friends or this cool musician that you know or whatever, uh, in that context, um, I think a lot of people, and I'm speaking for them now, unfortunately, um, but a lot of people, uh, uh, come up to us and say like it's, it's really annoying and really tiresome to be uh, categorized as a refugee all the time when really all I'm here to do is like play awesome music mm -hmm. um, and so uh, unless um, you're talking about the specific challenges that somebody has as a refugee um, we're all new Berliners. So. Unterscheidung Migrationsgeschichte und Migrationshintergrund diese Jugendlichen haben wenn man ganz genau hinschaut eigentlich nur eine Migration die sie erzählt bekommen keine selbst wahrgenommen oder keine Migration, die ein paar Jahre hinterher... Also ich zum Beispiel bin nicht in Deutschland geboren, ich bin in der Türkei geboren, bin mit sechs, mit sechs Jahren nach Deutschland gekommen, aber habe einen Hintergrund, der halt in der, mit der Migration verbunden ist. Aber diese Jugendlichen haben das nicht. Die meisten von denen sind hier in Deutschland geboren, in Berlin hier auf, auch aufgewachsen und es erleben Migration nicht, als, haben Migration nicht als Person erlebt, sondern das nur als Geschichte oder wie es war, oder wie es ist, in der Türkei, in einem der arabischen Länder zu leben, erzählt bekommen. <lacht>